Now, before I say something, I'd like to say something. It goes like this. 99.9% .9 of the times when I share something, it's something I learned, something I read, something I've already heard from others. What I'm, what I'm about to say now is what we call a boich svara. I made this up, so either you can just throw it out, or you can say this is genius, the choice, choice is yours. I just wanted to make that clear. We start every day when we dive in. And we say like this, Alta Bright and Sidder Nochulim are Kedem Hatfila. Hareini Mikabela Lai Mitzvasa Seshal Yata Rechel Kamecha, except upon myself the mitzvah of Abbas Yisrael. And then we say, Matoibo Elacha Yaakov, how goodly are your tents, Yaakov Meshkmesachi Yisrael, dwelling places, Yisrael. And the question is, is there any connection, correlation between this idea of the Yahaf Lerecha Kamecha and Matoibo? We all know why we start with Avas Yisrael, because Hashem loves our father when our children get along. And there's Achdus and Avas Yisrael. Hashem says, I want to listen to my children and fulfill their requests. That's why we start with Avas Yisrael. But what's with Matoibu? You see, sometimes we need to do Avas Yisrael. There's a crisis. There is a, fi a fire. Someone had a fire and they need help, Pasha financially. So we want to help, but we have to ask questions. What happened? Was there insurance? And we go into the details we need to know. Or someone's going through a health crisis, Rahman al -Islan. Which doctors are they using? What type of yedamach are they had? This, that. We need to be nitty grit, gritty and nosy. Or someone has to is going through a divorce. The family needs help. Can you help? Sure, we'll help. But do we know what happened or this? We have to, you know, be nosy. You know? What does the Pasuk say? What does Rashi say? That the what's the what's the good about the tents of Yaakov? The Pischeim, the doorways. We're not facing Zemulze. We're not the doorways weren't facing each other, meaning a yid didn't look into another yid's tent to see what's going on. There was a tremendous level of atsnias, tr tremendous level of respect of not being nosy and looking to someone else's tent. You see that? When you're doing Avas Yisro. Don't use that as an excuse to be nosy and to you know, nitpick into someone else's life. For sure help, use Seichel before you're giving money or doing whatever it is. But don't use Avas Yisrael as an excuse to be nosy and yent into someone else's life. Have a great job. All the best. This is my two cents. Take it or leave it.